So today we're here in Michigan at FEV. We have several of our engineers uh, on site working with their engineers. So it's really a, a team and collaborative environment to specifically work on packaging and placing the different components around the vehicle. This week we have the Hylion team here and we're working closely together on making final selections for the electrified components to add to the hybrid kit. It certainly seems, you know, dimensionally it probably gives us at least an inch, maybe even two inches in all directions for clearance. I think it's great that they can uh, come into a space that uh, they can add not just their highly on green color, but green environment, if you will, into this class eight space. Traditionally, of course, such big trucks were uh, uh, combustion engine driven. And so to bring hybrid, which is something unique, I think, into that, that space, I think it's pretty interesting. It's great to be here in person. Uh, it allows our engineering team to really work together and they can collaborate on the best solutions. Uh, FEV brings uh, a lot of synergy with experience from uh, other programs and they, they bring great energy as well. We have around five accessories that we have to shortlist today. So every accessory we look at the viable options inside the room, discuss which can be better, which we can get fast and which will work better for us and once we think that is a viable option, we take the dimensions, come out and see where we can fit it on the truck. We're basically trying to demonstrate uh, the technology, so trying to get uh, as many of the kind of potential production supplier components on a truck as possible. The goal ultimately is to prove that the technology can do what we hope it can do, which is provide a good ROI in terms of fuel efficiency and uh, power and functionality. Next, we're going to start our software bring up once the vehicles are assembled. Uh, we'll start doing some short drives and some functional safety validation work. Uh, and after that, we're going to hit the road and start to see what our customers and our, our fleet council members think of uh, what we built this summer. It really is looking at the powertrain in a brand new way. We feel that battery electric technology is fantastic, but the infrastructure just doesn't seem to be ready. So right now, this solution offers over 700 natural gas stations around the country, and this truck can work for a fleet right now. The Hylion and FEV are tightly working together with uh, experts from both sides, and so it's a, it's a nice program where we get to use expertise from both sides, gel it together, and come out with this program that we can both uh, stand behind and be proud of in the end. So the partnership is a big deal because FEV has a lot to offer and Hylion is now doing something that is very green and technologically advanced and the partnership is beneficial because we can support each other in getting our names known and providing a product to the world that is green and useful. Time frame is always scary because we are a startup. We'll have to squeeze everything in, finalize everything, get our system set and testing done. Everything is always, you know, compressed. But we love it, so we're working towards it and we'll get it done. We do need to move quickly and we need to make good decisions. So it will be a very, very busy summer. Uh, we have a really wonderful team and they're working hard. I'm really excited about the direction of these vehicles. Uh, I know the potential of the team and I feel like when we get to the end, uh, our customers are going to be very impressed. <laughs>